These two videos are getting more attention from you guys. That mean most of my subscribers are from JJK community. So here I am with another JJK video. Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we will talk about Megumi Fushiguro. Megumi Fushiguro is the sorcerer who took control over poor Sukuna's body and beating the shit out of all sorcerers. Just kidding guys, don't take it seriously. But today we will rank top 10 Shikigami from 10 Shadow Technique user, Megumi Fushiguro. So let's start the discussion about Shikigami. But before moving on to discussions, please do subscribe. As you can see here, lots of people just watch video, and don't even subscribe, and, that makes me very sad. We are so close to 200 subscribers, so please do subscribe. And now. Out of all the curse techniques revealed so far in Jujutsu Kaisen, Megumi Fushiguro's 10 Shadows technique has the most mystery surrounding it. Apart from the near limitless potential it seems to have and how diverse its combat applications have been, the Ten Shadows technique is the only thing in the series that has piqued the interest of Ryoman Sukuna. For someone who has been described as living solely in accordance to his pleasure and displeasure, Sukuna allowing himself to be influenced by another's technique is some of the highest praise in the entire series. Number 10 is. Rabbit Escape. Rabbit Escape is a diversionary Shikigami. Rabbit Escape isn't a singular Shikigami, but rather a swarm of mostly harmless rabbits that can grow to a near limitless number if their summoner wishes. Once initially summoned by forming a rabbit-shaped shadow, more and more rabbits can be materialized without any additional effort from the 10 Shadows user. These rabbits are no different from normal rabbits and have no additional abilities, save for their sheer number and potential to multiply indefinitely. Number 9 is Great Serpent. Great Serpent was destroyed permanently by Sukuna. While the Great Serpent seemed to have great potential as an offensive Shikigami, it was permanently removed from Fushiguro's arsenal by Sukuna very early on in Jujutsu Kaisen. This Shikigami takes on the form of a giant snake that seemed to be able to extend its length indefinitely. Its additional abilities are unknown, as it was destroyed in its first full appearance, but even then it made its power apparent. Number 7 is Tiger Funeral. Tiger Funeral's full abilities were never revealed. Tiger Funeral was one of the Shikigami tamed by Sukuna in the period between Gojo Satoru's escape from the prison realm and their fateful match on December 24. Unfortunately, this Shikigami was never summoned on its own. Instead, it formed part of the new totality, merged beast Ajito that Sukuna summoned to aid him in his battle against Gojo. As such, very little is known about this Shikigami. Fun fact, in manga when Sukuna summoned this creature, Gojo told Sukuna that he looks like lost child. Number 7 is Toad. Toad can be an incredibly versatile Shikigami. Despite not having the raw strength of the other 10 Shadows Shikigami, Toad excels in a support role when used in conjunction with them. It seems to have size manipulation abilities and can be much bigger than the average human at its largest. Toad has a powerful prehensile tongue that comprises the bulk of its support capabilities. Fushiguro has used this ability to pull off maneuvers that would be traditionally impossible several times, restrain his opponents or to pull his allies out of dangerous situations. Number 6 is Piercing Ox. Piercing Ox has the most raw power of any Shikigami. Piercing Ox was another Shikigami that Fushiguro wasn't able to tame, but was debuted by Sukuna in his battle against the reincarnated sorcerer Yorazu. Piercing Ox is a large, powerful bull with short horns, a broad face, and heavy set shoulders. This Shikigami has only one purpose, and that is to cause as much destruction as possible to anything in its path. Number 5 is Max Elephant. Max Elephant is the largest 10 Shadows Shikigami. Max Elephant doesn't appear as often as the other 10 Shadows Shikigami, but is always an impressive sight when it does. It manifests as a true-to-size full-grown elephant with all the weight and power of the real-life animal for which it is named. Fushiguro often takes advantage of its crushing weight to apply pressure on his opponents, summoning Max Elephant directly on top of them to force them into submission. Number 4 is Nu. Nu is Megumi Fushiguro's favorite Shikigami. Nu has the most appearances of any Shikigami due to its sheer versatility. It takes the shape of a giant bird-like creature with reddish feathers covering its entire body and a white carapace for a face. Nu is strong enough to carry both its own weight and that of a human being in flight, making it Fushiguro's preferred mode of transportation over short distances in situations where he doesn't have to hide his jujutsu. Number 3 is Divine Dogs. Divine Dogs are a jujutsu sorcerer's best friend. Divine Dog takes the shape of two dogs that are alike in every aspect except for their coat's colors. 
Compared to the rest of the Ten Shadows Shikigami, Divine Dog showcases the most affinity for Fushiguro. They respond to affection from humans much like any regular pet dog would and behave with more concern for Fushiguro and his allies than the other impersonal Shikigami do. This bond might be a result of how long they've been available to Fushiguro, as they are the first Shikigami granted by the technique. Number 2 is Round Deer. Round Deer is the only Shikigami with reverse cursed technique. Round Deer might not have much combat ability, but it is one of the most valuable Shikigami the Ten Shadows technique grants simply because it can project reverse cursed energy. Even among Jujutsu sorcerers, the ability to use reverse cursed energy to heal, much less project it to restore the wounds of others, is an incredibly rare talent. The fact that a Shikigami exists which is capable of bypassing the arduous process of cracking reverse cursed technique for its owner is nothing short of miraculous. Number 1 is Divine General Mahoraga. General Mahoraga is Jujutsu Kaisen's most powerful Shikigami. The eight-handled sword Divergent Sila Divine General Mahoraga is easily the strongest Shikigami of the Ten Shadows technique, and truly all of Jujutsu Kaisen. Its potential surpasses that of fully-fledged grade 1 sorcerers and even some special grades. Mahoraga manifests as a giant humanoid creature with four wings where eyes would be and a wheel hovering above its head. It is commonly referred to as the crown jewel of the Ten Shadows, even though, until Sukuna, no user of the technique managed to successfully tame it. And that's it. Hope you guys like this video. Tell me in the comment box which Shikigami, is your favorite. In my case I would say, Mahoraga.